is an example of factoring by taking out something common. Look at our first example and the polynomial 12x squared plus 9x plus 18. First focus your attention on the coefficients of 12, 9, and 18. Ask yourself, what do they all divide by? That's right, 3. Now look at the variables, x squared, x. Well wait, there's nothing on the 18. That means I can't pull out any variables. My greatest common factor then is just 3. So now it's just a process of asking myself, 3 multiplied by what is 12x squared? Oh, 4x squared. 3 multiplied by what is 9x, positive 3x. And 3 multiplied by what gives me positive 18, positive 6. So my answer is 3 times the quantity 4x squared plus 3x plus 6. Let's look at another one. 27x cubed plus 18x squared minus 36x. What do 27, 18, and 36 all divide by? Make sure you found the greatest common factor, 9. Now look at the variable terms of x cubed, x squared, and x. The only thing you can take out of them is a common x. So my greatest common factor for the entire polynomial is 9x. Then I ask myself, what would I multiply 9x by to get to 27x cubed? Well, 9 times 3 is 27, and x times x squared is x cubed, so it must be 3x squared. Now, 9x multiplied by what is positive 18x squared? 9 times 2 is 18, and x times x is x squared, so my common term is 2x. 9 times what gives me a negative 36x? Because remember, we treat the minus sign like it's a negative. Well, it would be 9 multiplied by negative 4 to get to negative 36, and the x is already on the 9, so I don't need any more x's. So my final answer is 9x times the quantity 3x squared plus 2x minus 4.